Today, Nigeria is history November 22. November 22, 1971, former Nigerian athletes Davidson and Osmond Azinwa are born. Davidson Azinwa won silver in the 100 meters race at the 1992 Olympics and set a world record in the 100 meters race at the 1990 IAAF World Junior Championships. Both of them with two other athletes won silver at the 4x100 meters relay in the 1997 World Championships. 1975, still on athletics, former Nigerian sprinter DJ Alu is born in Lagos. He specialized in the 60 meters. 100 meters and 200 meters events. He also won the 100 meters race at the 2003 Old Africa Games. 1982, former Nigeria football international Yakubu Aigbeni is born in Benin, in Edo State. He played in the nation's national team until his retirement. 1937, West African Pilot, a newspaper, is published in Lagos by West African Pilot Limited, owned by Dr. Inam the Azikiwe. It was a leading newspaper on the fight for independence. 2008, the first MTV Africa Music Awards, otherwise called Mama Awards, takes place in Abuja at the Velodrome and hosted by Trevor Nelson. 2005, former Inspector General of Police Chief Tafaba Logu is sentenced to six months imprisonment after pleading guilty to eight charges of corruption after his arrest in January of the same year. He was also fined four million naira and Properties and cash worth 150 million naira was forfeited to the federal government. 2012, Britain bans Nigeria based Islamic group Ansaru for its ties to Al Qaeda, making its membership and support a criminal offense. The group, according to Britain, was responsible for the kidnap and subsequent murder of a Briton and an Italian during a rescue operation. 2011, Senator Ali Ndume, representing Bonu South Senatorial District, is arraigned in a magistrate court in Abuja on terrorism charges. The spokesperson of dreaded Islamic group Boko Haram, Alisander Umar Kondiga had been arrested in the senator's house and the senator later confessed to knowing him. He was cleared of all charges six years later. 2015, the All Progressive Congress Governorship aspirant of Kogi State, Prince Abubakar Aoudou, dies of a bleeding ulcer in Kogi at the age of 68. Governorship election was ongoing in which he was in the lead, but INEC was about to declare the election inconclusive when news of his death broke. Today, Nigeria's history brought to you by Ojora Olabisi.